Hello, Ravens fans, and welcome to another edition of the Spotlight Ravens series. I'm Aaron Schneider, the Sports Information Director at Anderson University, and joining us from the baseball team it, um, is a senior, Nick Jones. How are you doing today? Doing well. How are you? Good. Um, first day, give a brief introduction. Um, Nick, he's, he's earned um, all conference twice in his career, earned first team honors as a sophomore and second team honors as a junior. For his career, he has a 317 batting average, has 113 hits, and four, 46 stolen bases. Um, to kick things off, what is your major and minor? Uh, yeah, I'm a, I was a finance major, and I'm now getting my master's at AU. So. Oh, okay. And what's it? What are you pursuing in there? Uh, business administration. Okay. Um, who is your inspiration, and why? Uh, my inspiration is definitely my parents, uh, just because of all the hard work, and they show me at a young age uh, what hard work will lead to. Um, it's just something. There's somebody I always aspire to be like. So. Okay. Um. Uh, what is your driving force slash motivation? Uh, yeah, I'd say I'm pretty self-motivated, um, but also competition. I love the competition aspect and uh, just being better than that next person is always something I wasn't always wanted to do. Okay. Uh, what is your favorite aspect about sports and why? Uh, definitely the people you meet. Um, just I've met some of my best friends through baseball and the connections that I've received. Just it's been incredible. Okay. Um, what is your favorite non-athletic memory at Anderson? Uh, probably freshman year in the dorms, just being with all the other baseball guys. Um, I didn't know very many of the guys coming in, just all living in the dorms together and hanging out every day and getting to know each other. Okay. And then what is your favorite athletic memory at Anderson? Favorite athletic memory? Uh, probably my sophomore year, um, the conference tourney run we made. We lost early and then had to win multiple games to get to the championship, so. All right. Uh, what are your favorite hobbies? My favorite hobbies, anything outside, uh, working out and playing golf. Okay. Um, what is a little known but amazing fact about yourself? Uh, I graduated college in three years. Okay. Yeah. Um, what, um, why did you choose Anderson? Uh, yeah, so I'm from Newcastle, so AU's only about 40 minutes away, so that was a, a big reason, but also uh, just the coach that recruited me did an incredible job with uh, selling the baseball program uh, in the university. All right. Uh, what is your favorite class at Anderson and why? Favorite class would probably be portfolio management with Dr. Lauders. Uh, I took it in undergrad. Um, I was a finance major, so this was an investments class. We were actually able to invest real money and just learn a lot more about the market. Okay. Uh, who, is your, who is your favorite professor and why? Uh, favorite professor would be Dr. Sylvester. Um, he made learning extremely fun and he really made you get out of your comfort zone and uh, think in different ways that you're not used to. Okay. Um, what are your plans after graduation? Uh, I just actually accepted a job last week to work at Charles Schwab in Indianapolis. Um, I'll be an associate financial services professional. There you go. Congrats. Thank you. Um, what do you want your lasting legacy to be at Anderson? Yeah, I just want to be known as someone who worked extremely hard and uh, made an impact or a positive impact on other people's lives. Okay. Um, going into the next segment of questions, the team superlative type. First, who on the team is best dressed? Best dressed, probably Benny Day. Um, Benny always has a new outfit on and just always is looking good. Okay. Um, who on the team is the best dancer? Best dancer would probably be Brandon Sanders. A uh, few people know, but he can dance pretty well. Okay. Um, who on the team is the Joker, prankster, best sense of humor? Uh, definitely Grant Thompson. Uh, he's always making jokes and having a good time and messing around. So. Okay. Um, who on the team is most outgoing? Well, most outgoing would probably be MJ Furnish. Uh, he's such a nice and genuine guy and uh, super personable and can talk to about anybody. Okay. Who on the team is the best trash talker? Best trash talker would probably be Logan Long. Um, he likes to talk trash about anything he does, and he's pretty good at getting under your skin. Okay. 
Um, who on the team is the pregame DJ? Um, I'd say a little bit of everybody. We all have our input on what we want to listen to. I don't want to say there's really one guy. It's just a collaboration of everybody. Okay. And then does the team have a go-to pregame song? Uh, yeah. I know Thomas mentioned it. It's called Dura. And we always listen to it right before we leave or go out to the field. And Adam Pascal does his famous dance to it. So. Okay. And then as a bonus, do you have a go-to walkout? Uh, go-to walkout would probably be – I'd say my favorite through the four years was probably uh, Juice by Chance the Rapper um, just because it was Nick Butcher's his sophomore year and him and I became very good friends. And then he was a shortstop and I became a shortstop, so I kind of took it over from there. Okay. Um, and then going into the final segment of questions, um, who is your favorite professional athlete? Favorite professional athletes, definitely Derek Jeter. Uh, growing up, I was always a shortstop, and this is someone that I admired his work ethic and just how he played the game, and I wanted to be like him. All right. Uh, which is your favorite season? Definitely summer. Love the warm weather and just being able to spend time outside and um, just enjoy that. Okay. Um, what is your lucky number? Uh, lucky number seven. Um, I was born on seven seventeen or ninety seven at like seven oh seven or something crazy like that. And there were so many sevens. I just <laughs> I was considered that to be lucky. All right. Um, what what is your what is your favorite sport outside of baseball? Favorite sport probably be golf. I love being out on the course and just being outside and enjoying the weather and playing some golf. Okay. Um, what is your favorite professional sports team? I'm a big Yankees fan. Uh, I'm an older sister, and her and my dad were both Yankees fans, so just growing up, that's who we always watched. Okay. And then what, uh, what is your favorite book? Favorite book would probably be um, a book called Can't Hurt Me by David Goggins. Uh, he's an ex-Navy SEAL, and it's just about his life and super inspiring and motivational. All right. Um, what is your favorite thing to do outside of your sport? Uh, probably just be out anything outside, outdoorsy, uh, work out, uh, any other sport really. I love to play golf, I love to play basketball, football, whatever. Okay. Um, do you have any pets? If so, what are their names? Yeah, I got two dogs. Uh, I have a Maltese Chihuahua mix named Gus and a Black Lab named Molly. Okay. And then – when, um, when you were little, what did you want to be when you grew up? Uh, so once I started playing sports, I wanted to be in the MLB. But always growing up, I wanted to be a fireman. Uh, both my dad and my grandpa are firemen. So I spent a lot of time at the station with them hanging out. And it's something I always wanted to do. Okay. And then um, have you ever traveled outside the country? If so, where? Uh, yeah, the first time I went out of the country was over Christmas break with the NBA program. And we went to Guatemala. But that is the only time I've been out of the country. All right. I think I've got all of my um, questions. Ravens fans, thank you for tuning in. Nick, thank you for taking this time to do, the, do this yeah. interview. Thanks for having um, me. Ravens fans, be sure to tune along. We've got, a, we've got more episodes of the Spotlight Ravens series coming. We'll have another one tomorrow. So we will see you tomorrow.